we did a needs assessment and chart reviews and we noticed that RNs weren't assessing patients for their pain and the doctors weren't um, documenting the pain scores in their notes. Um, so we started with staff education. We made sure that nurses were assessing uh, a patient's pain at every encounter. We also got the radiation therapists involved and uh, nutrition, social work, um, integrative health, we, uh, the medical secretaries, anybody who came in contact with the patient uh, during a patient encounter, we made sure that they were asking a patient how their pain was today. And um, <clears throat> we had to let the doctors know to include a pain score in their note. A lot of um, doctors weren't pulling in the pain score for their documentation, so we had to rearrange how they documented. Um, and it was a month by month basis. We would educate, we would review the charts, we would make the assessment if our scores were um, being consistently documented, and then we would re-educate um, as need be. That was a two-year span, and we noticed from the beginning of the project, our pain was documented about 20 to 30 percent of the time. After two years, we're finally up to 90 percent to 100 percent of patients' pain being documented. There was a significant increase with that.